All right, I am back from more videos and unboxings. I want to show you on uh, Yakuza 6 uh, right here. Uh, I haven't done this one yesterday because I was... Uh, I haven't done this one yesterday at the midnight release because yesterday I was uh, pretty exhausted. Uh, I just got back home home from spring break. I was at Linwood last uh, last uh, Sunday for, uh, for a drive around with my family. We just drive around to... Uh, I went to H Mart and I went to another castle. Uh, it's a it's a retro video game. It's a retro video game store. It has some use. It has an arcade machine. It was really fun. There was a comic book store near me, so I went there. I didn't really buy any comic book store book books because they're actually the same thing. Nothing too big, but I like the comic book store. It's really fun over there. Overall, I mean, I enjoy my spring break. I had to take a break. I gotta take a break from social media because, or and making videos because I find social media right now to be a bit more intoxicating right now. Uh, a lot of, a lot of problems. I don't want to give. I don't want to go go over that, but I just want to take a break from that because I just want to let you know. I just I deleted, I I canceled my Facebook uh, because I was too. It was I didn't really want to use Facebook anymore because of how how toxic it is. Yeah, I, I don't want to deal with uh, too many trigger warnings and witch hunts, so so I'm more happy because uh, after a few days, I felt happy that I didn't really use Facebook anymore because I wanted to do more of this stuff, but I just don't want to, I just don't want to ruin, because I don't want to ruin every, I don't want to ruin my lifetime, so when I was young, I was happy that I did not use social media back then, so maybe by the time I get older, I won't be using uh, Twitter or or any other social medias, any or Snapchat, anything like that, doesn't matter. But I will be doing more videos like this. If you guys really want me to do more stuff like this, I'd be happy to do so. So yeah. By the way, I mean I felt pretty good though. So yeah, I felt pretty good. I'm I'm still doing okay though. So if you guys worried though, so yeah. Anyway, with all that bullshit, I want to tell. So this is Yakuza 6, The Song of Life. Uh, this game came out since 2016 on the week before Christmas, around December. Let me check the date. Uh, yes, this game came out since December 8, 2016, the week before Christmas, since two years. years so yeah, I mean, this game had... This game had better sales than Final Fantasy XV, though, so yeah. Do I think this is the best Yakuza, Yakuza game? No, because I'm not... First of all, uh, sorry, I mean, I'm a little, I'm a little... Sorry, I mean, I feel a little weird. First of all, uh, this game, I'm not... I mean, I still like it, it's just not really the best one. I still love Zero. Uh, the original one from 1 and 2 is still good. 3... Three was great. Uh, four was still good. Five was actually better. Been on was still good also. But you know this one, it's not the best. It's not the worst. But I'm just the thing I'm not really a fan about this game is actually the combat system. The combat system feels a bit different than because I remember in Yakuza Zero you get to use the D, you get to use the D pad to to change fighting styles whether you want to do rush or heavy or mons or or beast mode or weapon mode. Whatever it is, uh, you know, you guys remember from Zero, you get to change combat. I, I prefer something like that. I really wish they would have done something like this, but still, it's a good, still, it's a, it, still, I mean, the Yakuza series was known for, for a good storytelling, though. So, yeah, I want to open this shit up and see what it looks like. And I just want to let you know, I finished playing Zero, though, so I've already completed, completed the game. Now I need to finish uh, Yakuza 1 and 2. Two. I didn't play the... The remake version is because of, you know, because, you know, I don't believe the remake games like that is that perfect. I prefer the original one with the, with the PS2 graphics and the, because, I mean, I, because it still looks, because of nostalgia, it still, it still looks fine though, so yeah. So yeah, so if you guys check on the webs, so I want to give you guys a little bit of, a little bit little bit of information about I want to 
this is related to the Yakuza series because I remember right now uh, Atlas and Sega are now working together on doing the Persona 3 and 5 dancing simulation games. Uh, right now uh, Persona 5 is having a Yakuza DLC a DLC and uh, you know at Persona 3 they're also going to be a, a virtual fighter DLC for Persona 3 though so I'm really interested to see what what that version will look like during the western western time so yeah so yeah I mean I know I talk a lot so yeah here's the front yeah I show you 360 degrees of it here and here's the bottom right here here's the tattoo the the dojima no you and here's the uh, box. I mean, here's the Majima, Majima Goro. So here's the uh, Hiryu Kazuma, Hiryu Kazuma. Uh, here's the bottom. Here's the side of it right here. So this thing comes with shot glass and an ice. And some ice to it. And here's the game. Right here in the front and the back. I mean, the Japanese. Uh, I remember the Japanese version, they had the uh, Japanese text to it though, so here's the uh, coaster, the uh, doji, dojima no yu, the, the dojima kado, the dojima family, and here's, here's what the coaster looks like, pretty unique with different colors right here, the clan, and here's the, um, I know what's inside here, some, uh... Here's a bag. I've done an unboxing of Yakuza 0, still won the, won the best one, hands down. Here's some ice. You put these in the freezer to turn this into ice, so, so yeah. Here's what it is. Pretty cool. Pretty nice, pretty nice weight to it. So I wanna open the game for a little bit. By the way, the whole Yakuza series is still good, and I've heard they're making Hoktoku, Hoktoku, yeah, Gotoku. Uh, it's actually like the Fist of the North Star. Uh, it's about to come out around maybe this year, next year, who knows? It's actually, it's actually, it's a. You guys remember Fist of the North Star? Uh, you know the anime. Here's the game of it, and here. Here's what it looks like right here. You know, the Japanese version is actually a bit different, uh, you know, I remember it has the text to it. I mean, the Japanese version costs a lot, though, so if you had, if you already had the Japanese version, then you really don't need this, but if you wanted the collector's edition, then you might want to get this. So yeah, and here's the, um, shot glass right here. Oh, is there anything in here? Maybe a book? Oh yeah, here it is. Here's an art book. I can't show you everything. Here's the... Looks pretty cool. The Onomichi, Majima Goro, Taiga Saijima, and uh, Haru... Samura Haruka, and Samura... And here's Makoto and Lee. Here's, and this came from... This is really cool. I can't show you everything at once, but... Here's Kamuro Cho. So, yeah. So, yeah, I do speak Japanese. Not a lot, but, yeah. Here's Onomichi. I want to give you a little spoilers because I've seen the whole Japanese gameplay though. So yeah, it looks cool, looks blackish, and uh, yeah, here's what it is. Here's the shot glass, so yeah. So yeah, I might get the I might get the Japanese version of Yakuza 3 and uh Yakuza, Yakuza 3 and 5, because you know in the American release they sent they in America, they they censored a few things. Do you guys remember from the uh, Resident Evil uh, one where uh, in the Japanese version where Chris was uh, smoking a cigarette? You know. So yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I don't want to break this. And here's the shot glass. Here's the Dojiman Hue. It looks pretty good when you put a coaster right here. When you put something like this. You know, this is a pretty interesting uh, limited edition. I really don't want to break this in case if I want to return it. Just so you know, the shot glass are the same thing. So yeah, here's what it looks like. So yeah, I mean, that's all about it. Uh, what do you guys think? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Did you guys play this? Uh, 
Uh, did you guys like it or hate this game? I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you guys like about it. Uh, please follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Just those two. Uh, like I said before, I just sh I just shut down my Facebook because I don't want to deal with the witch hunts all day. So yeah. I mean, that's all I'm going to have to say about this. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Like, favorite, share, subscribe. Uh, you know, let me know what you guys think. If you want me to do more of this stuff. And uh, this Thursday, I'll be getting the God of War 4. Uh, ten get get a God of War 4 on on a midnight release uh so yeah I'll be doing I'll be doing that one so I mean this is all I'm gonna have to show you guys I hope you guys enjoy the video I'll see you guys I'll see you guys maybe around the near future to do more stuff like this hope you guys enjoy the videos and uh peace the fuck out